We're going to talk a little bit of, uh, more today about foreign policy. I guess I just like the environment because I guess everybody I do, most of my friends are here, but it's nice because at Pineview you don't have to be embarrassed about being that nerd kid and being smart and all that. You know, you're more admired for that, not like ostracized. Support economic growth and human rights around the world. Pineview is an open book way of lesson planning. It's you kind of roll along with what your students are capable of learning and then you even want to kick it up another notch. Talked a little bit about these yesterday. I want to get into Stanford and study business and Pineview's going to help me. Hey, check this. It's so fast. You're like, Look at, this. at Pineview I guess it's more okay to be different not that kid over there. It's nice to be smart and not have to be like oh I don't need to be too smart because she'll care or he'll care or whatever. Well, let's ask this group over here. Uh, Sierra what do you think? What kind of language would we call that? Well you gotta be thankful that it's public you know so you don't have to pay anything and it's just such a great education. So what'd you say? We tend to get a reputation as a elitist or almost private like school, and we're so far from that. Uh, we're definitely, and I'm very proud to say, a very public school. Uh, we allow, uh, allow, we we want people from all diverse groups and from all different areas of Sarasota County uh, to come and apply and join in, and we're really looking to educate the future and kids that hopefully will solve problems that we're trying to solve today and, and make the world a better place. And as a teacher here, uh, I really take that into consideration when I come into my job every day. I mean, that's, I sometimes I almost get goosebumps some days when I get students that I just know, oh my gosh, I can't wait. I just can't wait to see what you're going to do and create down the road in the future. So you guys were great. You're right on. Okay, today we are going to be working on TI Inspire activity to help us review a little bit of systems of equations and finding equations of lines. I've been here since second grade, so I met so many people and my old school is pretty much just preschool so this is like the school that I've been through my whole life. R has to coordinate with the E. I think it's great because at other schools it was sort of easy. I think for most of us it was and this is more fitted for our learning style. I love coming here every single day. It's a great job. I tell myself all the time how lucky I am to teach here. Sure. So there's better options for schooling. There are better options like outside of school. There are clubs, electives. And it's just better than most other schools. They also find a grid of numbers. The kids are great. They're excited to be here. They love to learn. It makes my job fun um, because I love to teach. So it's great to have students who are willing to learn from you. I got I got Okay, so what's your clue? You're being ahead of level, sometimes even two levels, and it's um, it's better for college and things and later in life to have that type of things on your resume. I think it's an advanced school for all classes, not just math, science, but social studies, language arts, optional classes other than this like tech, PE, and all that. It's just all around really good. Put and drag it across. I'm happy to be here every single day. Okay, guys, great job today. You guys did an awesome job figuring out the clues and finding the hidden treasure. Um, tomorrow, we're going to look a little bit more at developing our own code, and we are going to write some of our own secret messages to each other.